guys, this is just a reminder to make sure to go follow me over on Instagram. It is Jeffrey underscore James underscore reviews. Follow me over there to see updates and talk pro wrestling. What's going on, boys? Today we are back with another video, and I am very, very excited about this review. We have the Elite Series 111 Sandman figure. I am so excited that this figure exists. Pretty crazy that in 2024, this is our first Elite Sandman figure. This is the first one ever. Um, Sandman just recently, I think, signed a Legends deal with WWE. So now we have a uh, a, a Sandman figure. And we're going to get Sand, Sandman merchandise. Hopefully more Sandman figures to come. I would love a later years Sandman uh, ECW, like 06 ECW, you know, WWE ECW uh, Sandman. Because... I don't know. For me, that that that's a good Sandman figure. Um, I, I, I don't know. I, I love the Jax figures that were in that attire, that black shirt with the black pants, the the you know the bob wire tattoo. Which I'm we're gonna look over this because I, I, maybe he didn't have the bob. Like on the back, you can see like I don't know if you can see that, but like a little bob wire around the wrist, like a little bracelet. Um, but he also has like his face or somebody's face like right in here and his and his inner bicep too. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if he didn't have that then or what, but this is like an early ECW Sandman, so very excited about this. I did not really want the Chase one with the American, the red, white, and blue, you know, American flag pants. These pants are sick. I would wear these to this day. Anyway, let's look over the packaging. We got Sandman there with all of his accessories. Sandman, first time in the line, first ever uh, Sandman figure in Mattel at least uh picture of him there picture of him there picture of him there you know all the good stuff uh some stats all of that we got the ad read there and the rest of the figures in the set maybe you're gonna pick up that Cody eventually but other than that maybe the ricochet too that ricochet looks pretty good um the Balor I hate that head sculpt so I'll pass on that but the Cody I may pick up but those pinless knees man I just uh, <laughs> Uh, Sandman, first time in the line. Uh, professional YouTuber here, man, doing all the right things, just killing the game. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. So let's go ahead and look over this Sandman figure, take him out of the packaging, and uh, 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 off to Never Neverland. All right, here we got Sandman out of his packaging. I'm loving this figure so far. I really, really like what we got going on here. We get a ton of accessories, honestly, for this being just a elite figure. I know elite figures normally come with accessories, but there is a lot to go over here. So let's go over everything. You don't get just one. You don't get just two. Not even just three, but four beer cans. Four total. Count them. Four beer cans <laughs> pretty insane uh four of them is kind of crazy but sandman's a big big beer man you know he's gonna drink his beer so he needs he needs a couple um uh, we also get these wider open hands i'm assuming that will hold these beer cans let's try and see sure enough it will so yeah you can put those hands in there and then you got uh, him drinking a, a, a nice beverage there. Uh, we got the kendo stick, of course. I would have been pretty upset if this did not come with a kendo stick. It's kind of... Uh, uh, I why do I want, keep wanting to call him Hangman? I'm, I'm tripping. Uh, Sandman's... There we go. Sandman's uh, kind of whole gimmick is, you know, the kendo stick. So pretty cool. We got that there. So there's another accessory. Then... You get this bobbed wire that is literally just wrapped around him, which is pretty sick. And I'm not even sure how we're going to get this off. <laughs> uh, I'm going to try to pop this head sculpt off, and then maybe that'll make it easier. If we can do that, swipe that off. Or maybe it'll just kind of fall off around him. I think this is, is this the first time we've gotten bobbed wire from Mattel also? I didn't even think about that. This is, I think this is. That's pretty crazy because, I, you know, we've gotten bobbed wire, a good bit of bobbed wire stuff, honestly, from AEW. We've got the, uh, 
the Kenny Omega, John Moxley, two pack blood and guts, two pack thing. We got, um, yeah, there we go. And we got this Bob wire and it's really just like a long, like just line of it here. Thought it was like all wrapped together and it may have been, I might've broke it. Who knows? No, it doesn't look like it. So you got like a big spool of Bob wire here, which is pretty cool. You can use this for anything. If you want to have a death match or whatever, you got some Bob wire. But yeah, I think this is, this is the first time Mattel's attempt at Bob wire. And I mean, this is a long string here. Let me pull it across the string, uh, across the screen so you can kind of get a perception of it. Still going, still going. So yeah. That is a pretty long string of bob wire there. Pretty cool that you get that. And then, on top of that, you get... Ah, there we go. You get a all-white ECW shirt, which is super sick. I like this shirt a lot. Um, nothing on the back. It's just Velcro on the back. But let's go ahead and go with the figure now that we've <laughs> done three minutes on just accessories. Um... Uh, we got the head sculpt here. I wasn't too fond of this head sculpt, but now seeing it in person, I don't mind it. It's not terrible. Um, definitely not a bad head sculpt, but I uh, think it could be better. I think it could have been better, but it's not bad. We do have, like I said, the white ECW shirt. Now, if you do want to remove this shirt for whatever reason, he does have kind of a white singlet top on the bottom if you wanted to to rock that look which doesn't look terrible but i i don't know i think of sandman with a shirt on i don't really think of him with the with the singlet look uh plain arms no wrist tape no tattoos unfortunately like i said i want the sandman with the bob wire tattoo um and then these pants dude are so sick there's so many little like details in these they're pretty much just like a bunch of skulls some eight balls i know it's kind of hard to to see it here uh yeah skulls eight balls like a skull with some top hats just super sick man like i would wear the hell out of these pants if they uh if if i could find them so and he does have pins in his knees thank god um so that way he's not you know his legs aren't getting super stiff and then we do have i think these are like shack Aren't these Shaq's shoes, the Reeboks? I can't, I'm not a sneakerhead, so I don't really know, but uh, I think they're like Shaq's shoes, apparently, or something. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe they're somebody else's. But we do have kind of a loose ankle here. That kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Dude, this figure is awesome with the amount of accessories that you get with this and uh, it being the first Sandman figure, me being a Sandman fan, me being an ECW fan. Uh, yeah, this just rules, dude. This is so sick. <laughs> I uh, definitely gonna make the top figures list, I believe. If I have to, if I had to guess, this is gonna be in there. Um, we got him drinking a beverage there, if he wanted to, and he can bang it on his head like the psychopath he is. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Sandman is just unhinged, man. He's a crazy man. Uh, there you go, bam, breaking it over his head coming out to metallica raising some hell that is some good stuff there i like it so there you have it man that is the review of the elite 111 sandman figure probably one of my most anticipated figures of the year this year damn it this beer can keeps falling out of his hand I, i'm just i'm dumbfounded that we got four beer cans that's just pretty pretty crazy but if you wanted to pose him up there there you go with his beverage and his kendo stick ready to whoop some ass coming out to metallica very sick figure man i like this a lot it is 10 out of 10 for me uh super hyped about it and it it does the job i think so that is going to do it for this elite 111 review of sandman thank you for watching uh if you guys aren't up to date i deleted instagram for the foreseeable future make sure you are um subscribed so that way you know that videos are coming out um we'll probably be back on instagram another time right now we're just kind of taking a little break from it so in the in the future you know we'll get there but let's uh let's have some fun until then so thank you guys for watching make sure to like comment subscribe turn on the notifications professional youtuber ah, do all the stuff i'll see you in the next one